Now, here's a man on the right who is concerned not so much with using water as with finding it. He's an Australian professional man, and water divining's his hobby. He uses a piece of wire instead of the usual fork stick, and so far he's located no fewer than 35 wells. And in each case, given the depth at which water could be found to within a few feet. With an average man, the wire doesn't react. But when the diviner takes hold as well, the effect is as though an electric circuit had been completed. Easy, you might say. He could turn it down himself. But look at this. All the strength of wrists and arms isn't enough to control the movement of the wire. And if you want further proof, see how the downward force has pressed the wire into his thumb and finger. Whatever the explanation, the diviner's discoveries have meant the irrigation of thousands of acres that would otherwise have been parched.